Hi, I'm Sue Street. I'm um, the Senior Land Service Officer for Livestock at Central West Local Land Services. Um, today I'm going to have a chat to you about the best method of collecting your feed samples for a feed test. Now we're going to talk about how you take uh, fresh um, pasture samples. So we're going to do what we call as a pluck sample. Um, we try to use it as a representation of either a sheep or a cow eating. So if you're um, collecting a sample on something that you think a sheep would be eating, you actually try to take more of the leaf matter. Um, whereas for cattle, you try to take pretty much the whole plant because they, they can't be as selective as sheep can. So when taking fresh pasture samples, I do a zigzag pattern across the paddock and I take between 15 to 20 grab samples. As I'm walking across, I do tend to um, take my sample from my where my toe lands to try and make the sample as unbiased as possible. You can see we've tried to fill the bag up as much as possible. Um, but you can also see that we've got a lot more stalk in this sample and that's because we've selected it for cattle. Whereas if we were selecting for sheep, we'd probably see a lot more um, leaf and stem. 